Space. If you experience um, sometimes if your phone just uh, go off, turn off, turn off by itself, or you get a lot of drop calls or things like that, and you don't want to do a factory reset, which is basically is delete all your personal data. So I want to uh, go two steps with you on how to possible um, treat your phone to help and work properly. So first you're going to open settings and find general management and now let's go and hit the reset button right here. So reset button and let's go and reset network settings um, which is this one is only going to remove you uh, reset your Wi-Fi connection so if you already have a Wi-Fi uh, connect to your phone you have to after this you have to enter the password and also any Bluetooth device will be disconnected and also you have to re-enter the password in order to uh, connect again with your phone which is uh, very simple it's only four or six zeros to connect your Bluetooth on, on this device Okay, and mobile data, this is what you wanna, we have to reset the phone, okay? Um, my light bulb, it looks like a, a alien there on my screen, so I apologize. <laughs> it's a reflection of my light bulb, but uh, it's just a light bulb, it's nothing. Um, and um, it's past Halloween, but I didn't decorate my light bulb as of Halloween, so. <laughs> All right, so just hit the reset settings. Um, this is gonna refresh your connection. Uh, so you're gonna refresh your SIM card and um, your APN values. So, um, but you won't you won't lose any personal data, like no pictures, no videos, uh, no contacts. Contacts will be lost, or no applications downloaded will be lost. Just a refresh on your cell phone's network settings. Okay, so after asking your lock screen like pattern password or pin you want to see this uh, reset button so just touch the reset and now at the bottom you have to see a uh, passive network setting set that means that everything went through all right uh, your sim card is work pro working properly and now uh, the other option that uh, is um, it really is going to help a lot is the phone must be power off so let's go and power off the phone and this is a samsung galaxy um, a10e and, and also same steps for galaxy a20 okay so now with the phone power off um, we're gonna use the volume app and power key you want to press these two buttons together and as soon as the phone uh, vibrates or samsung logo appears release both keys immediately and just wait a few seconds you're gonna see a recovery menu on the screen okay uh, one and uh, one more thing by doing this your phone you you're not gonna lose any personal information no email no password no application no contacts no videos pictures and nothing will be, will be lost on your phone okay so let's go and press these two buttons Vibrates, release both keys, and wait a few seconds. There you go. And now, this is the trick. We're going to use volume down. And some people, well, they call actually hard reset, which is, it's okay. But we are doing not a hard reset. We just want to do a, a network reset. So, using volume down. We want to highlight wipe cache partition. This is what we want to do. Okay, so uh, wipe cache partition. Let me focus this properly. There you go. And now I uh, press the power key to confirm. And uh, wipe cache. So the cache, this is what really uh, uh, ruins the motherboard of the phone. Okay, because so we failed to reboot our phone at least three times a month and the battery is not a removable battery like before the phones on the old times and they just remove the battery and then power on the phone again and boom it's done but these phones are internal batteries so 
we actually we don't remove the battery because you have new screws and need special equipment to open the phone and and reset the phone from the battery so um and since we have a lot of um web history and we we don't reboot the phone that's when it ruins so this is what we need to do if we are doing here box basically and um, remove every single thing that you've been removing from your phone's system okay once highlight yes just press the power key and at the bottom is wiping cache formatting cache cache white complete cache white complete okay uh, last steps reboot system now the phone is automatically highlight reboot system now just press the power key and the phone will be uh, start a reboot itself okay so uh, it's gonna take a few minutes for the phone to take us to the home screen all right so um, these are the two steps that um, I hope that it's gonna help you to uh, fix the issue of your of your phone and uh, find my other tutorials related to this smartphone in case that you f happen to forget your password pattern or pin blocking the screen with the phone okay so we are here on the main screen okay so yeah so this is how to reset the phone so let me know if you have any other questions please subscribe to my channel hit the like button and if you would like to leave us some tip to improve my channel um i have my venmo account on my uh, comment section or the description of the video or paypal if you would like to smell to, to place any small amount even 10 cents if you would like to um help the channel to improve okay um find my other tutorials so in case that by accident your kids activate a voice assistant and it is uh, kind of tricky to use uh, the phone with the phone assistant i mean voice assistant and also i have a tutorial how to disable that how to um, reset the phone when you forgot the lock screen uh, and credentials or your about keyboard or anything else okay thanks so much choose my videos hit the like button and subscribe thank you